Ciao, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with a, with a challenge and I am doing the no makeup, no makeup, no mirror makeup challenge and I was tagged by Annette and I have done this before but it was like two years ago I think and it did not went so good and when Annette did this it looked super good and I was like what kind of sorcery do you use woman? How did you manage this? So I'm trying this today and I have set a timer of 10 minutes because my camera st stopped recording after like 11 minutes or something like that and I also saw when I started the camera I have not so much battery left so I really hope that the camera will survive but I have flipped my viewfinder around and we're just going to start and I don't think this is going to be good so I will start with my base I have thought about that this how I if I should do the base or the eyes first <laughs> I was thinking about doing my eyes first if I have fallouts but I don't going to know if I have fallouts until I'm finished so yeah I'm going to start with my base and I start with a primer and this seems like the easiest thing. And I have used palettes without mirrors. And all the products without mirrors. So the primer is on and this feels like the thing I can't I can't go wrong with. So I'm just going to let this sink in a little bit. For foundation I am using the Lumina Natural Glow and NYX Drop Foundation. And this, this is soon empty, I don't know if I can... No. And I am going to film more videos after this day. Um, but I am pretty sure that I have to redo my makeup, so... And mixing the foundation. It feels like the foundation is going to be the easiest. Maybe I shouldn't have said that before I'm done. The foundation. I have no idea how much foundation I have. I usually doesn't use up all the foundation. I don't know if I have too much or too little foundation right now. And I don't know how I'm going to find out if I have too much or not. And I have a mirror on the wall but I hang... I have a blanket in front of it and I also have a mirror behind me. doesn't feel like I have foundation all over my face right now. Okay, take a little bit more. <laughs> okay, so maybe like that. Foundation, 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 foundation. I'm just going to take my makeup wipe because yeah. <laughs> I can't check if this is okay or not with the foundation, so I just have to. I go with this. And then I'm going to take some concealer, but maybe not, so okay. Okay, it feels like I took too much. It feels like I have something in my eye. Okay. 
I hope that this is good and then I'm going to set it with my uh, powder and I am a little bit afraid of this because I don't want too much It feels so strange to do this, even though you have done your makeup so many times. It feels strange to do it without seeing anything. Okay, so maybe to the eyebrows. Or should I powder? I powder my face first. Maybe should have put up my hair for this. So something like that, and now I have about one minute before I have to start the camera, and I'm going to do some contour, and I will take this from Nabla. It's Gotham, and I do not want too much of this. But I usually do this twice on each cheek and a little bit underneath my shin. So, um, blush. Oh. And I take the. Mm, mm, I take Kendra, this one from Noble as well. And I really hope that I am filming again. And that felt too much blush. I feel a little bit stressed when I'm doing this and I don't know why. Maybe because I do not know what I am doing right now. That I have to do and then I will take this one. Baby Glow as my highlight. And it feels like highlighter shouldn't be so hard either. I just remember I usually don't use this brush for this highlighter. But I hope it will be okay. So the base is hopefully done. <laughs> I am going to do my eyebrows and I do not know if you're allowed feel where your eyebrows are am I allowed to do that or should I just oh it's a mirror mirror in this one but I will hold it like this I forgot about that um, so I hold it like this I promise I won't look Okay, here is my eyebrow, that did not feel right. Like the worst thing would be if I did my eyebrows better without seeing when I do when I see. And I can see the brush when I do this. It doesn't feel like I usually do that. So this feels so off. But I think I can hear that I am doing something and have hair underneath and there I missed my eyebrow. I don't understand how Annette did this. And this is not my eyebrow, this is something else. That is my eyebrow. I 
can hear it is an eyebrow but this is not the shape of my eyebrow whatever <laughs> then I'm going to take my eyebrow What is it even called? Tinted brow gel? Did I at least hear it? No, oh, I took it too far down. That did not feel good. It doesn't feel good right here. It feels like I have the worst eyebrows ever. So now I'm going to do the easiest part with my base. I'm going to use a fixing spray. And I can't can't go wrong with this one because I normally close my eyes when I do this so okay now it's time for the eyes and maybe time for me to get blind I don't know so I use my eyeshadow base my eyeshadow primer and this should not be so hard either because this is no color no nothing okay so time for the eyes and I am using some of my makeup geek shadows today I don't know if this is a super bad idea because it was long long time ago I did use the, these anarchy bitten and cherry cola I'm going to use bitten in my crease And I can't remember that this has fallouts. And it feels like the crease is the easiest thing because you can really feel it. I don't know why I keep saying like this is the easiest thing. When I most certain look like crazy. And it feels like I have to be so concentrated. And I do this so I don't hurt myself in any way. <laughs> so I take this the whole way in. I don't know what I am most afraid of. Maybe the mascara because sometimes I poke my eye when I have a mirror. So without the mirror I most certainly would poke my eye. I think. Okay, and then I'm going to take... I like that I do this like a tutorial. <laughs> I'm going to use the Cherry Cola. Or is it Cherry Coke? Cherry Cola. And I'm going to use this on my outer half of my crease. And I don't remember if this has fallout either. So I'm going to tap it off. like this is not going good at all. I don't even know where to look when I do this. So I'm sorry if I'm just looking down but I don't know where else I should be looking. And then I'm going to use, I, whoop, I don't know what, if you can see, this one. This is Anarchy. And I'm going to use it in here. Oh, I think I poked my nose. Did I? I think I did. So the eyelids are done. And now I'm going to use Bitten again and put it on my lower lash. And this feels also a little bit scary. I 
Okay, so now it's time for mascara and I hope the eyes doesn't look too bad, but it feels like when I am seeing what I am doing, it feels like I go on for such a long time and now it was like done, so I guess that's not looking correctly and now I'm going to use mascara and okay I have to be quiet for this one I can feel my lashes but it feels like I am just on top of them. Now I got mascara underneath my eyes. I think I have mascara here. It felt like it got a little bit wet. So I'm going to use some lipstick. And I don't know what will go good with this look. I will take Stone Fox. It's a very light lipstick and just save myself. Even though there is no salvation for this. So I am done and I am going to take up a mirror and see how I look and it feels like I have mascara here and nothing else is good looking so... Oh! Nice eyebrows! <coughs> what the hell is this? This went pretty okay, it's not so much color on it but... <sighs> what is this? I will turn the viewfinder as well. Oh, hello. But I think the base... The base is pretty good. Maybe a little too much contour here, but... Else? Okay, so the camera shut off and now I have loaded it with a little intense bit of battery. So I think we should speed this up. And I don't know how much I had time to say, but I think... The base, it's nothing special and it's, it looks like it usually do. Um, not too much contour, just a little bit. The blush I could have taken more and the highlighter as well, but the base is okay. <laughs> the eyebrows are not okay. This brow is pretty okay. It's not so sharp that I usually do them and out here it has almost no color at all and this brow <laughs> I have two streaks here and then the brow doesn't look good at all the eyeshadow I think it's it's pretty good I could have done a better job but it could also go worse so I think I want to do a look with these shadows when I am seeing what I'm doing because I really like this and I think it, the colors are good, but I should have taken them down here. They are not completely down to the lashes. And the lashes are not black the whole way in. And also, I have some mascara hair here. I don't know if you can see it. But the mascara isn't the whole way in on the lashes. And that's not good and not the whole way in. And also, I should have put something on my lower lash line, but I didn't want to take that risk. And the lips, I chickened out a little bit by taking a light lip. But it is... Okay, so it went better this time than the time before. And I am... I'm okay, I wouldn't go out with this because this eyebrow looks crazy and I have mascara here. But the base, I could go out with base, it's nothing wrong with it. And if I just clean up the eyes a little bit, they are okay. So it went better this time, not as good as it did for Annette. Because I don't know how she did that. So this was my no mirror makeup challenge. And I have evolved. It was so much better this time than the time before. 
So I really hope you liked this video and if you want to do this challenge as well, do it. It's fun and it feels so strange and I don't know how it can be so hard when you have put on your makeup so many times. But I think it's a fun challenge and to, to see how is how you are doing and uh, yeah it's a fun challenge and if you do this challenge please comment down below so I can check your video out because I think it's fun to see how people think when they put on their makeup when they can't see what they are doing so I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and yeah I see you in the next one bye